Today when I was at gym, I was thinking about something. I thought I will record this. So that's why I just came from a gym and I want to record this topic. So our memory is made up of two attention, voluntary or involuntary. Do you know for the voluntary attention, we need to spend a lot of efforts, time and all that. But for the involuntary attention, we don't need to spend effort. For involuntary attention, we need only three things. your desire your curiosity and interest so if you are a person who want to make a cyber career in cyber security and you are very confused about whether yeah, you want to go for soc you want to go to vapt or you want to grc you can just spend your time on this area that uh, is it bringing us some desire when you learning a grc does it bring you more curiosity Uh, are you passionate about the time uh, do you feel not a burnout and all that so if you can able to spend from this perspective i'm sure you will definitely love one of the particular field so one thing is that for involuntary attention we need three things without that you can able to achieve any kind of attention one is called desire interest and curiosity so next time when you figuring out about cyber security career give at least 3 to 4 week time understand all the vertical see which which vertical giving you more important to desire which giving you more curiosity which giving you more interest let's take example in vapt is it your desire to exploit more system is it a curiosity to learn new way to penetrate the system do you have any interest to learn about new topics does it not make you burn out so this kind of a things you have to do same with soc also uh, do you have an interest to learn about new ransomware does it bring a curiosity up what next after doing letter movement does it bring a curiosity or does it bring you interest or desire how can i basically hunt for the new threats so these kind of a things you can definitely look for it and that give you the long standing career in cyber security do let me know how do you find this wisdom of thoughts thank you so much